Yo, yo, Reds fam, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a fantasy draft challenge. Now, you guys may be asking yourself, didn't you say you're going to stop doing franchises on the channel? Not stop it. Taking a break from franchise, but I am going to continue doing the fantasy draft challenge. So, in this episode, we're going to be doing it on the Pittsburgh Pirates. Recommended by the main man, Josiah Bomb. Comment up here. Yeah, up here. And, um, yeah, let's see how this goes with the Pittsburgh Pirates. Yeah. Let's see what we can do. <laughs> Hopefully, we break the deadlock in this episode. All right, folks. We are now at the draft. We get the 21st pick of the draft, unfortunately. Not too low, but still a little bit a little bit low. So, we got, we still have a good chance of getting some pretty good players. Uh, trying to see. trying to scatter around with who we should get. Um, Yogi Bear would probably be all right, but I haven't seen Yogi show up on the, you know, whenever they get, like, on the, you know. On the list, uh, most hits and all that stuff. I've never seen Yogi up there, so that's quite the motivating. But we do have Jackie Robinson. Should we go with Jackie? Oh, Nolan Renato still available. Nolan Renato is still available. Um, debating on. I'm really. I, I really want to take Arenado. Do we take Arenado, folks? Yeah, we gotta take Arenado if he's available. Let's go ahead and take him. All right, folks. Pick number two has to be a pitcher. Literally the quickest decision I've ever made it may have made in my life. Chris Sale, welcome to the team. All right, pick number three. A lot of players have gone by. Uh, let a couple players go by. I want to focus on. I want to focus a lot on the rotation. That helps us win games. You guys should know that. If you guys don't know, that's a little mini trick. Rotation does help you win a lot of a lot more games than you think. Um, let's see. Let's see. Who do we still have available? For the outfield, Cespedes still available, JD still available. Um, no, no good right fielders. But let's see, Trey Turner. I don't want to know about Trey Turner. You know, if you know why I don't want to know about him, do not mention it in the comments. Yes, I know what happened. Um, shit. Do we go Edgar Martinez? Yeah, let's go ahead and drop Edgar Martinez. All right. Fourth pick of the draft, number four. And Cespedes is still available. Let's go ahead and scoop up Cespedes. All right, the last pick of the draft. We're going to select. We're going to select the pitcher. Uh, don't know who. Actually, I do know who. We're going to draft the Tsunami. Just because. Dominican. That's my boy, mi pana. And let's go ahead and get him. And all right, folks. We are now at the season. We got Chris Sale as our ace. Let's go ahead and look at our scouting. How does it look? Um. Okay. Well. Okay, well, let's go and look up our lot our, our team. We got Nolan Renato, Chris Sale, Cespedes, Carlos Martinez, Edgar Martinez, Mike Scott. We got Andrew McCutcheon, Jose Reyes, Rod Carew. All right, we got an all right. You know, we got a we got all right. We got uh, Rod Carew, Chris Taylor, uh, Edgar Martinez, Nolan Renato, Cespedes. Okay, this is better than last time. At least they're all 80 and above. And let's check our rotation. We got Chris Sale, Carlos Martinez, uh, Jordan Montgomery, Kevin Gosman, and Ryan Yarbrough. And our closer is Mike Scott. We got Jordan Higgs, a flamethrower. Um, overall, pretty good team. I'm, I'm quite, I'm quite excited. We're the, technically we're the fourth ranked team in the league. Have a pretty good and stacked team. You guys know how this goes. All star break. I'll see you guys there. And folks, this might be it. At, at the all star break, we are currently 57 and 40, looking good so far. Let's go and look at the lineup. How everybody's doing. Rod Carew is hitting 280. I lead off. I like that. Jose 256. Uh, Edgar Martinez is slugging pretty good. 289. Not too bad, but not. Eh. And Renato's 254. Not not too well. Sense best is the one though. 298 with 21 and 67. I'm liking that. And overall, this lineup is meh. Not like oh my god, but it's meh. And let's go. Ooh, shit. Let's go to check our rotation. Chris Sales 95 with the 3.65. Uh, Tsunami is 9-5 with a 2.90. I like that a lot. Um, our rotation is doing all right. They're not doing too bad. They're doing all right. Let's go ahead and check the league. How, let's see the disabled list. No one's in the disabled list. Thank God for that. But uh, JJ, uh, JJ Reddick. <laughs> Josh Reddick is uh, in the lead so far for the batting average. And let's see. Do we have anybody in the top 10? Something that we don't, sadly. 
We do have someone uh, top 10 in hits. We got Edgar Martinez, third in hits, tied, um, tied for third with P.B. Reese. And we got um, Jonas Cespedes tied for six with hits. So that's pretty good to see. And a bunch of guys here at bats, doesn't matter. Home runs, Cespedes at uh, tied for 11th. And for RBI, Seth was tied for uh, sole possession. No, tied for sixth with Willie McCovey. And Eric Martinez tied for eighth with Jeff Bagwell. So, yeah. This, but we're looking good so far. We're going to go ahead and simulate to the end of the season. See how we do. Hopefully, it ends up like this. Hopefully, not better. And let's see if we make the playoffs. And all right, folks. We have now made it to the playoffs as a wild card team. Surprisingly, we went 88 and 74 with a 543 winning percentage. Um... Overall, pretty good season. Um, we're facing off Miami in the wild card. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> we're facing off Miami in the wild card. Um, hopefully we win, but I do want my my Martins to push through. But let's go ahead and check how we did for the season. 276 wild crew here. All right, we're looking through them right here. We did pretty good. Cespedes ended up being the main power guy in our lineup, as he did hit 35 home runs and 112 RBIs. Um, good averages, good averages. We're hitting for good averages, not too bad. Let's check out the pitching we did. 12, Chris Hill did 12 and 7 with a 2.236 uh, ERA with 270 strikeouts and 222 innings pitched. Beautiful. Uh, Tsunami went 15 and 7 with a 3.30. Nice, nice, nice. Everything went good. Ricky didn't do as good, but uh, that's fine. <laughs> Gonna check the disabled list. Anybody there? Daryl Sweeney, Jacob Wilson, GG's. Um, our MLB leaders, Mike Scott, actually led the league in saves for this season. That's pretty much the only thing. Babe Ruth ended up leading the league in average. Nice. He had 50 home runs and 129 RBIs. Who got the lead? Yeah, Babe, Babe got it by a long shot. <laughs> Holy crap. And let's check the awards. Did anybody win an award here? Seth Lewis won a gold glove. And Chris Sale won the Cy Young Award for this year. That is amazing. Let's go ahead and see, folks. This is the game right here. Do we win? Do we beat the Marlins? We do beat the Marlins. Oh, no. We do beat the Marlins. But now we're going to be taking on the Phillies. We're going to be taking on Shelfie and his Phillies in the um, NLDS. And let's see how we do, folks. Take this game by game. We lose the first. No. I'm dead. I'm so dead. The curse is going to keep going. I don't know when this is going to end. Oh, my God. All right, folks, we got eliminated by the Phillies. That is quite unfortunate. Uh, eliminated by the Phillies. Could have gone far. I felt this team was this team felt really, really, really good. Um, just couldn't pull it off. It happens. Uh, hopefully, the next team is going to be it. But uh, that's going to be it for the episode, folks. If you guys want your team to be featured on this series, comment them down below. Before And also, before you guys ask for a team, right? I do have a playlist set for the for the players. I mean, for the um the past episodes of the past team. Make sure to check those out and then comment because you know people have, people have been commenting teams that I've already done and um uh, you know just I'm probably just gonna have the play uh, playlist link down below in the description so you guys can just click it, kind of check it out through there. And uh yeah, make sure to uh comment down below your teams. I am gonna be looking at the comments. I am gonna be scavenging the comments looking for which teams is gonna be the right one. And hopefully the next team is a team for us to win it all with. Most importantly, folks, subscribe. We're getting really, really close to 400 at the time. We're five away. Five. Literally five away from it. Um, it's going to be a, a beautiful milestone ahead. I am going to be doing a giveaway, a $10 PSN code as the as a thank you for you guys. It's going to be a giveaway. Probably going to do it with the comments or probably going to be doing it on Twitter. So you guys want to follow me there. Twitter.com slash Resi. Yo, R E S A. R R E S S Y Y O, and yeah, stay tuned. All right, folks, it's been your boy Rezzy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, peace. When I pull up, you can't see to many bitches just wanna be my lady.